Vectric Cut 2D, you would go to Vectric.com and click on Downloads and then select Trial Software and then you can choose Cut 2D, Download Free Trial. And you have a choice of downloading either the desktop version or the pro version. Uh, the desktop version is limited to uh, two foot by two foot. Uh, the pro version will allow you to do longer projects and has a few extra features. So we're going to download the pro version. And that will begin and you save the file. Now I've already done that and so that file is already in my download folder so I'm going to hit cancel. Okay, and to run that program, I'd click on my downloads and double click on the file. Then I would select yes, I do want to install it. And it can take just a second to uh, load the program. When the uh, system is done verifying the installer, it goes ahead to this menu and from that point you can just click the next button and it will pop up the license agreement. Uh, this basically says that you will uh, abide by all the rules and you click I agree. I'm going to leave the shell extensions in place and I'm going to hit next. I'm going to take the default settings that it provides for me and hit install. And that will add a button to the startup menu. And you can see once you get to this point it's a fairly quick process for it to install all the drivers to um, make Cut 2D Pro happen. You just uh, click finish and it will automatically run the trial version of Cut 2D. And there you have it. If you'd like to get a, uh, a copy of the program again, you can go to Vectric.com and download the trial. Uh, if you'd like more information on Cut2D and how to use it, um, you can go to cncroutertips.com and uh, there will be tutorials there and instructions and videos on how to use Cut2D. Thank you.